we present a large-scale mechanical components benchmark for deep neural networks. Why a mechanical components data set is needed. Mechanical components, as shown in the figure, have sharp edges and high genus, which distinguish them from common objects. Furthermore, mechanical components are categorized by their detailed shape, whereas common objects are mainly identified by their general shape. Our data set enables data-driven feature learning for mechanical components. Exploring the shape descriptor for mechanical components is essential to computer vision and manufacturing applications. The contributions of this work are the following. First, we established a hierarchical taxonomy of mechanical components. Second, the creation of a large-scale mechanical components benchmark. The mechanical components are annotated by mechanical engineering experts. Third, we benchmark seven classifiers and analyze their performances. Fourth, we developed a web-based framework that has viewing, annotating, and filtering features for guiding annotators. Not much attention has been given on the creation of a large-scale mechanical components data set. This is because acquiring 3D mechanical components is challenging and annotating mechanical components requires engineering knowledge. To resolve this difficulty, we established a hierarchical taxonomy of mechanical components as a guideline. We developed a web-based platform to manage collecting, viewing, filtering, and annotating data. The web-based platform has the advantage that users are free of software installations and can easily access the platform from any computer with an internet connection. This accessibility accelerated the annotation process. The annotator supports viewing multiple parts as a tabular to see the consistent shape features within the same class rather than viewing each individual part. These functionalities make the benchmark creation faster and more accurate for fine-grained categories. As shown on the comparison table of the MCB dataset with other datasets, we collected 58,696 models from 68 classes. In the table, CO and MC stand for common objects and mechanical components respectively. To see the effect of orientation variance property of descriptors, we created dataset A and dataset B. Dataset A consists of 70% aligned objects and dataset B is not consistently oriented. We benchmark seven descriptors on two datasets. Rotation net outperforms the other methods on both datasets in the classification task. We observe that the performance of rotation net decreased on the retrieval task. This is because RotationNet predicts view orders of given multi-views to learn rotation invariant features. However, the view orders of solid of revolution shapes of mechanical components are hard to determine. To see the similarity of geometric features from descriptors, we performed the TSNE method. We observed that the tighter the clusters, the higher the retrieval accuracy. For example, features from point CNN are tightly grouped by the same colors, but features from VRN were not well clustered. As a result, point CNN performed better than VRN on both classification and retrieval tasks. We will release our dataset on our project page. Thank you for watching.